look at this madness. I'm actually recording something in the middle of the day. Um, we just got done with lunch. Uh, we went to a few places this morning. This week is still archaic Rome before the Republic. So 700 to 500 BCE. We went to uh, some church, some old, old temples that we can't actually tell anything about at San On Onobono, which is a church built in the 15th century. Then we walked up to the top of the Capiline Hill and saw some stuff, the largest temple ever can built. Well, a single wall of the podium, which is the foundation. And the Brute statue, and then the She-Wolf, Lupa, which was really cool to see in person, but fellow tourists were incredibly rude. Which was not great, but happens. Um, I was not super pleased we spent far too long just chilling on the terrace of the Capitoline when I wanted to explore. That's where the Colossus of Constantine is and the equestrian statue of Marcus Aurelius, which is still bronze because the uh, Christians thought that it was Constantine who was the first Christian emperor, but no, Marcus Aurelius, who hypothetically was a type of philosophy which is extremely close to Buddhism, which was pretty awesome. Um, and then we headed back. The bus was crowded, had lunch. Why I'm really recording, I think, is because I'm super excited that I had lunch with Dr. Draper and Dr. Spaeth. Uh, Draper is young and his focus is on Horace, and then Dr. Spaeth is quite a bit older and she's the professor in charge. And we had some awesome, very casual conversations. I got some wine tips from Dr. Spaeth, looking at you, mother. Um, yeah, but the conversation with Dr. Draper was awesome. He just kept talking and was very good about look, like talking about our interests and sharing his own interests instead of just like, oh, what are you interested in? Cool. He'd like keep up the conversation and bring in tidbits, you know. It was awesome. I loved it. So for the rest of the day, just kind of hanging out at the Centro, I had to go get money for my permesso, my like permit to be in the city long term, which I found out once I have, I can get a pass for five euro to go to several museums, including the Capitoline, however often I want. Um, and then I have Greek tonight, and that's it. So, sounds like fun.